uh, computer device with a full QWERTY keyboard. Uh, the reason that we're up here is uh, to show you that this, this device uses WiMAX technology, which will virtually allow you to connect online anywhere, uh, anywhere in the world where there's a connection. So it's kind of neat. You can surf the net, you can send messages, uh, you can uh, communicate, social networking, and uh, do pretty much anything you can do on a normal basis. Welcome. My name is uh, my name is Mark Lewison. I'm the president of Nokia Inc., which is the North American arm of, of Nokia. So welcome. I uh, I wonder how many times you come to a press uh, briefing where you sign a liability release. You know, imagine a device that can deliver tailored information and entertainment to you based on contextual information. If a device like this realizes that we're here in Las Vegas and you know, nice idea to do this in the sunshine. Uh, it's just after 1 p.m. and knows information about my likes, my dislikes, my friends, family, and more. The types of services that it can bring to us are endless. So tailored searches, directed advertising, dynamic social networks. Simply put, internet services that are not possible in a fixed environment will become the norm and make a non-mobile experience seem as antiquated as that newspaper I used to get on the front door. So that brings me to our announcement. Today we're announcing a new product that brings all of these exciting elements together. Mobility, a full, rich web 2.0 experience, context awareness. This is the new Nokia NA10 Internet Tablet WiMAX Edition. Yeah, it's a long name. It doesn't really roll off the tongue, but it's able to bring you the internet directly in the palm of your hand, and that, I, we believe, certainly speaks for itself. So while, while the internet tablet platform is not new to Nokia, the addition of WiMAX is. This is Nokia's first WiMAX-enabled device. Most of you have probably heard plenty about WiMAX technology. If you haven't, it's a wide area data technology that delivers broadband speeds that most people would expect only from a fixed connection to a mobile platform. Like the Nokia NA10 WiMAX edition, Nokia isn't just delivering devices. Through Nokia Siemens Networks, we're bringing together a full end-to-end -end solution to WiMAX providers like Zone, who are here at CTIA today demonstrating their WiMAX technology. You know, for me, I actually have two of these devices in my home today. One sits on my nightstand, and it's replaced the stack of magazines that used to be there. And the other sits in our family room, where we stream Rhapsody, and use that actually connected by Bluetooth to our entertainment center, and that's our, our music experience at home. Interestingly now, I don't just do that in my family room. It's anywhere I go, anywhere I am, I can enable that music experience. We also have another product called Hava in our booth where I can watch my home television on the NA10. I also can watch and see what my kids are, uh, kids are viewing, and if I need to, I can even change the channel from Las Vegas to Connecticut. So, the untethering of instant messaging and VoIP from a fixed connection will open up incredible, in, incredible possibilities as well. And, you know, working for a global company, I see firsthand every day how people in, in long-distance relationships can maintain their connections through clients such as Skype. So wireless technology has always been about finding better ways for people to stay connected, and this, we believe, is yet another step forward in that evolution. So if, uh, if I were to summarize this, we'd say that you know the industry for many, many years has talked about making the vision of the mobile internet a reality. Obviously, that vision is quickly becoming a reality. Today is, and with the announcement of this WiMAX, the, the Nokia NA10 WiMAX edition, we think this is another very large step on the path to the mobile internet. And in short, it changes the very nature of the internet. So with that, I think we would open it up to questions. I have a couple.